Sheena aka Determined to Satisfy. Today is Sunday, August 2nd. So I wanted to talk about what I plan to focus on this month. Um, today is day 80 of the D to S 100 challenge. And that challenge is all about moving your body um, for at least 25 minutes a day for 100 days in a row. I have not made it this far in the challenge for a long time. I'm talking about years. I started this challenge over so many times. So I feel good, you know, I have been moving my body no matter how I feel, no matter what I wanna do, no matter what I don't wanna do, I get up and I get it done. Some days just in my bedroom dancing, outside walking, you know, really just focusing on closing my rings on my Apple Watch, um, hitting at least 10,000 steps a day and moving my body and a little extra each day for 25 minutes. Um, so for August, now I really want to focus on what I'm eating because I have been eating better, you know, 80-20, but in the last few weeks, I think we're going down to like 70-30 more than 80-20. Um, so one thing I know that helps me is meal prepping. Even though right now I'm home, I'm not in the office, when I meal prep, I know what I'm eating. It takes the guesswork out and I'm more likely to make decisions that's going to bring me closer to my goal. You know, I don't really restrict myself on what I can eat and can't eat. I'm really trying to focus on my portion size, um, you know, eating healthier more. And I, I say eating meals that are going to bring me closer to my goal um, versus those meals that won't. So, yes, you know, I eat pizza, I eat McDonald's, I'll eat Chinese, but that's not the norm of what I eat Monday through Friday, Mon you know, or even on the weekends. Um but because I've noticed, you know, in the last two two weeks, my eating has been a little, you know, not too good. I said, you know what, it's time to meal prep. Um, a little different this time because usually I'll meal prep and I'll put each meal in little containers and have them ready for the five days. This time I'm just making containers where I can grab and go. You know, I have one with my Brussels sprouts and I'll show you all this later. I got one with sweet potatoes, one with some cucumbers, peppers, onions. Um, and then I made tuna cakes because I've been eating a lot of um, ground turkey, whether it's chili or meatballs um, or tacos or um, lettuce wraps. Everything is usually some type of ground turkey. So I wanted something different. So I said, you know what? I was on YouTube. I watched different recipes and I decided to go with uh, making some tuna cakes. Um, I didn't want to make egg muffins this week. I really feel like having my high protein, low carb pancakes. And I will shoot you guys a video for that. It's very easy. It's just one banana, two eggs, a little bit of vanilla extract. I'll add some of my super green powder to it if I want to make a chocolate version. But I like having that in the morning with my strawberries. I already have my strawberries cut up. They're already ready to go washed. So I can just make those. Um, that's going to be my breakfast. And then I have the Brussels sprouts, the sweet potatoes. I have those ready to go with whatever, whatever I eat them with. You know, I have the wings that come from BJ's, like the Tyson wings, where I just put them in the air fryer. So I, let's say I make the wings, I can eat that with some Brussels sprouts or eat that with some sweet potatoes. I can have the tuna cakes. I have some um, guacamole. So just having those different options helps me throughout the day um, not think about it. And it's gonna help me bring me closer to my goal.
Thank you.